Hi guys, I just love pressing play myself. It looks kind of awkward. Um, I'm Dana with Dana Jo and Co. And we are talking 90 tips of content to help support your business. And we are here with day two of our tips. So today we're gonna talk about who are you in your business. And I think that's really smart to identify way early on. Cause if you don't, you're kind of gonna be like changing up who you are throughout the years of your photography business. And then it's constantly like starting over. And I don't know if you like starting over, but I don't like starting over. So I'm gonna adjust this a little, there we go. Um, yes, I, no kidding, run um, Buchanan Photography with my husband, we do it full time. And we have literally started over three different times throughout our journey as photographers. Now that we do this full time and we call Phoenix, Arizona our beautiful home, we can be more consistent with the style of who we are and really fall in love with the scenery and where we shoot. Also why we moved back here because we chose it because we love it so much. But I wanna know, where do you live? What type of style of photography do you shoot? Who are you in the world of photography? So when I say that, I want you to think of the last photograph that you just shot. Where were you? Was it an actual session? Was it a wedding? Was it an engagement session? What is a, was it a newborn? Was it a portrait session with family? Was it a styled shoot? Were you excited? Were you happy to share those images? What did they look like? What was the feeling that was coming out of your camera? And I really want you to think, is that the work that you wanna portray on social media? If that is your work, then guess what? That is who you are. So you'll see different things when you scroll the feed. You'll see people who are really dark and moody. You will see people who are very light and airy. You will see people who have a very filmy look with really cool greens and desert and redstone, red rock and all that fun stuff. You will see people who are bright with pops of colors and they really don't, un, you know, saturate anything because they just want it all to pop off the screen. You will see people with very flat images, you know, and it's unsaturated. Um, you're gonna see people with a lot of green. You're gonna see people without any green. You're gonna see people with a lot of green edits. You're gonna see a lot of people with a lot of orange edits. It just depends on what you like. Do not copy something because you think that that's what other people wanna see. When you find what you like, who you are as a photographer, it will show, it will shine. And you know what it's gonna do for your business? It's gonna target your audience. Your target audience will just come flowing. It will come find you and it will help you reproduce what you love to do over and over again. So for us, in the beginning, I kind of, my edit style was all over the place. I look back at old photos and I'm like, what was I thinking? I tried editing every single wedding to match the feel of that wedding. I'm not Mozart, I'm not a composer. It's not about a feeling, it's about consistency. And when we started shoot, shooting more consistently in Arizona after we moved here, we really developed our own style when it came to our look and how we shot photos. And then how we edit is simply just a little bit in post-production. We don't really change a lot. We just kind of put our stamp on our images. But I know that I am in love with the desert look. I am in love with the red rock scenery. I am in love with a hint of grain with a little bit of natural light and colors to truly show. I don't make things super bright and airy and I don't make things dark and moody. I like things to be in its natural element. That is me. So I wanna know, who are you? Who are you as a photographer? What makes your heart pitter patter when you see an image? And if you don't know who you are, I wanna challenge you to take a screenshot of your Instagram. So like maybe nine little squares or whatever, like a grid. And I want you to post it on today's challenge. And I wanna see if we can figure out who you are and what type of style of photography do you shoot. So are you dark and moody? Are you light and airy? Are you filmy? Hey, you get it? Filmy? Like, do you filmy? Okay, never mind. Just forget it. Have a great day. Talk to y'all tomorrow.